and godly TV programs. After the prophetic night in the prepared saints' ministry on WhatsApp, the Lord opened my spiritual eyes, and I saw a very shocking vision. I saw some young people watching an ungodly TV program, and what they were watching was very worldly and ungodly, and as they watched, they laughed, talked to together. Yet I was very stunned that these people couldn't see what was going on in the spiritual realm. For they couldn't see it. For I saw that while they were watching, there was a demon which was literally standing beside the screen, in the living room where they were watching the ungodly TV programs. This demon raised his hand and was literally giving in evil suggestive words to the minds of these young people. It happened in the vision that as the young people watched this worldly, ungodly programs that was shown on TV, the demon literally transferred his own thoughts to the minds of these people, compelling them to learn, imitate whatever evil they were watching. Portals through ungodly TV programs IT was as though the ungodly program which was shown in the TV was a sort of portal that attracted the demonic spirit to the living room and I saw that when evil slang or insulting words, or immoral words were used, the demon gave a suggestive words into the mind of these people, and the demon literally say to one of these young people saying, why not also use this insults on whoever offends you, and so, that person literally hears this words in his mind, but actually thought it was his own human thoughts speaking to him. Among the ungodly programs on TV, the Lord warns strongly against this show called Big Brother, ungodly fashion shows, afterwards, the Lord also revealed to me in another scene, and this time, I saw what was like a fashion TV show that was shown in the TV and watched. This time, I saw that there were literally some demons in human flesh who were working in this particular fashion house. These things were happening here on earth, but they were demons in human flesh, and a particular demon in human flesh picked up a tight clothing material, and was explaining to the other demons saying, this one is very much fitted and we must keep showcasing this kinds of cloths and make it look very irresistible and attractive, so that the humans will copy it when it is displayed. I saw this particular demon discarding another cloth which wasn't tight fitted enough, and the demon then picked up a cloth which was similar to the precious cloth, only that it was very tight fitted, and this demon explained to the others, how it is more tight fitted and how that humans will watch and copy the style once it is displayed on their screens in fashion shows, and the demons were all cheering in an agreement. And then the vision ceased. Avoid evil communication, then the Spirit of the Lord spoke to my spirit, saying, many Christians watch whatever that is shown on their TV screen, and then take it all as normal, yet it ought not to be so, for worldly movies, profane musics, and immoral fashions are also been displayed as well and my people must be careful not to watch these things which corrupts the soul, and the Spirit of the Lord gave me this scripture below and says that it applies to every forms of communication we do on earth, here is the scripture, 1 Corinthians 15 33 be not deceived, evil communications corrupt good manners, the Holy Spirit also said that I should note the word be not deceived in the scripture above, and that it was written because many could be deceived, and the deception is much in this last days, for communications can come in divers ways, and we should never be deceived. You should know that no matter the means of the communication, that if, what has been communicated is evil, then it can truly corrupt your good manners. An illustration, then immediately, I saw a bottle containing dirty water that was poured away, and the Holy Spirit explains that, just as the impurities has stained and corrupted the purity of the water, insomuch that it was afterwards thrown away. Even so, those who keep corrupting themselves with the impurities and filthiness of the evil communications of watching worldly shows on TV, immoral soap operas, immoral musics on TV and so on, will indeed stain their souls, insomuch that they would be a cast away in eternity except such person repents while there is still time. May the grace of the Lord be with your spirit.